Uh, ten years after his first shots came, and uh, someone who was uh, involved in that ten years ago and is here today, of course, is Adam Mecky, who's alongside me, so it couldn't have worked out much better. The teams are out. Dorkin, it's a 3-5-2. Dan Lincoln in goal, Isaac Philpott, Dan Gallagher and Barry full of the centre-backs. Seb Bowerman on the left, uh, wing-back, Nicky Wheeler on the right. George Frankham, new signing from Crawley, or just left Crawley, kind of miss it. And McManus sends it out to the left-hand side to Bowerman. Can he get his cross in? Oh, it's touched over. Just grazes off the head of Cordner. He's up. Scorpion kicking it forward. I don't think he meant to. Nice sharp turn from Mamalusa. He can now get away, possibly, from Philpot. He's down the right-hand side. He's into the edge of the penalty. He squares it, looking for Effiong. It's a great little toe poke away from Effiong. Heads it intelligently into the path of uh, a, a, a Dorking player, but shots have nicked it. Partington into Glover. Glover back to Partington. He plays it forward to Amaluza. Oh, tries a shot from distance. And uh, it's high and wide, but uh, it is the second effort of the afternoon. It's Glover turning sharply. Is he going to try a shot from distance? Oh, he plays it on to Willard. And you can hear the frustration in my voice, shots fans, because that was bright play from Glover. He could have had a go himself, but... Willard again in a good few months now is Willard turning the ball inside to Glover. Glover gives it back to him uh, and Willard can go one-on-one -on -one if he's quick against Fuller. He goes past him into the area, squares it across. Effiong, shot, is blocked. To split the pitch then there could be acres of space there to play in. Uh, Monoga sends a ball out to the left flank. Effiong against Gallagher. Effiong's got the power, turns inside. He's into the area and shoots, it's saved. Followed up, into the net. And Justin Amaluza finally has his eighth goal of the season. Effiong outsmarting the previously unbreached. Gallagher. Lots to play for rather Long way to go. Another, another 45, and um, yeah, that's half time there. So, yeah, no, again not out of sight, out of mind, so we can really you know, get back into this and, and it would be no surprises if, if Dawkins go and score a couple of goals. There you go. That's the words of Adam Mecky. I'm Rob Worrell and you listen to BBC Radio Surrey Sport. The second half with this free kick out on the left. Floats it in, corners up, gets his header on target. And do you know what? It's only just wide and... Thursday's normally a, a free training <laughs> quiz on the opposition. Free kick to shots. Level with the left-hand side of the penalty area, but about 35 yards out. It's just really going to be Harfield sending it in. Main targets are Cordner, Partington and Effion. Fryer's back there. In comes the ball. Partington header on. Pretty weak, though. On target. Partington sends it into the direction of Willard. Willard's got Harfield down the left-hand side. He's down there. Ball comes in. And it skids across in front of Effiong and in front of Glover. Mecky, I'm Rob Worrell, shots one, Dorkin nil. There's Cordner playing the ball through to McCoy. He's on the edge of the air, is he going to try a shot? He does, and it's wide. And, uh, Agriculture up in the air, and McCoy does well. And Effiong's through here in the inside left channel. Can he get a shot away? Yes, no! He's missed the target, just as you expected, the net to bulge. Sides which is good news uh, for all the shot, but not for the other three teams, for Dorkin, for Crawley and for Woking. Here's Amaluza with the cross in the box. McCoy, another header, wide again. Partington sends it out to the right-hand side to the official man of the match, Cordner. Is he going to try a shot with his left foot? No, he squares it to Glover. Glover plays it out to the right-hand side to Partington, who shift it out of his feet and get... Oh, it's a lovely cross! And there's the goal from Ryan Glover! to wrap up the points for Aldershot Town. There was, there was, I think Effignon just got the better of him once, maybe twice throughout the game, and he's had a real hand... hand um, All the ball's bouncing free, chance for Briggs, and it's saved wide by Ashby Hammond. Sorry to cut you off, Adam. No. Briggs clips the ball in, it's cut out by Glover, goes towards Effignon got the ball out of his feet and he's on the charge he's got Harfield running left of him he comes inside one two oh another little shot and a touch and then he 
manages to poke it over via a deflection from that man again. Composure from Pendlebury touches it back to Amaluza. He strokes the shot in. Brilliant save away to his right by Dan Lincoln. It won't count for a lot. There is the final whistle. No time for the corner for shots. It's been an entertaining afternoon here at the EBB Stadium. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.